Hello, my name is Leo and welcome to the week of Toki Mickey Memorial Forever with you. Make sure to record this on the 4th of August because I'm in Australia at the moment. And I'm not going to take my fucking, <laughs> fucking Japanese PlayStation 2 to Australia. Just so we can fucking do this. No. Um, speaking of this, uh, the stuff I want to talk about, we'll talk about it later. Let's, uh, let's do whatever this says, because something, something cool is about to happen. I need a translation. So what is this? Uh, from tomorrow, summer, what is that? Summer holiday? Summer training camp. Eh. Eh. Summer training camp. I don't know what that's all about. Let's find out. Okay. Since this episode will come out while you are in Australia, you should do it in your thickest Aussie accent. Alright. Alright. Oh, good day, mates. We're here at summer training camp. What's going on here? Oh, we've arrived at the training camp. Alright. Oh, okay. That's it. Okay. Kino. Uh, I'm gonna show you... I'm gonna show you some, um software that I got yesterday. Uh, yeah. Oh yeah? Hey, Koba? Oh, I'm gonna show you some fucking software that I got yesterday, hey! It's real fucking... I can't do this. I'm muddy. Where's your little wallaby at? I have a, I have a. Ah, uh, it's not here. I have a little um, a little kangaroo puppet thing. <laughs> I do actually. What is this? I'm not. Wait, what is this? I'm not very confident, but how was it? Time a kangaroo down, sport. Time a kangaroo down. Turn all fucking things here. Time a kangaroo down. What's what, what, hang, I'm sorry. Yes. What's his name again? Rolf? R R Ralph? You can't spell his name, can you? No, it's not Ralph. It's Rolf. Yeah, it is Rolf. Right. Is he Australian or British? I know he went to England. He's Australian. Yeah, okay. And then, uh, yeah, he was convicted in England for sexual assault of four underage girls. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I mean, he was born in Western Australia, so... It's not... Anyway. You know your best export is Margie Robbie, Margot Robbie? I don't know about that. What was that funny wobble board he used to play? Yeah, who cares. Dude, Margot Robbie is not our best export. If anything, our best export is Hugh Jackman. God, I love that man. Also, um... Uh, fucking Chris Hemsworth, but... I've been watching, like, interviews of, like, Ryan Reynolds and Hugh Jackman for the, um... Deadpool and Wolverine movie. I'm like, god damn it, man. Like, maybe, maybe I'm just being fucking wishful thinking, but I just feel like he, those two guys and Chris Hemsworth... 
Uh, I think we'd fucking go on like the house on fire. Sorry, we'd get on like the house on fire. Yes, thank you, sorry. Like, I think, I think we'd fucking have so much fun. Not that they'd give me the time of day or anything, but... If they did give me the time of day, they'd be, we'd be amazing friends. It'd be so cool. And then they'd have all the money and they'd be able to buy me stuff. They'd be able to buy me <laughs> stuff. Ah, Guy Pierce, of course, of course. And, um... Wait. Wait, hang on. Hugo Weaving is Australian, right? Sure, yeah. hell. Right? Yeah. Oh my god, Hugo Weaving's British? I didn't know that. Was it? I thought it was Australian. Um... Oh, I guess he moved to Australia. Born in colonial Nigeria. To English parents, he has resided in Australia for the entirety of his career. Oh, well, there you go. I thought you fucking go. Learn something every day. Silverchair, yeah. I remember when Silverchair was like really popular in what the 90s? I remember like watching, uh, like, not watching, reading, um,. One of the Narnia books is like literally called Silver Chair. So, wait, is Savage Garden? Hang on. God damn it! Wait, is Savage Garden Australian? I'm not confused. Yeah, no, Savage Garden are also Australian. There you go. From Brisbane. Yeah. They're from the same town that Bluey's from. Oh, blowy. Anyway. It's not Koala Man. It's not Damon and Darren. Uh, Damon, da Damo and Darren? Damo and... Yeah, whatever. It's no Smiling Friends. Now, yeah, well. Smiling Friends is good, but... I think Koala Man's my favourite. But it is Australian and it's great. Anyway, what are we... Justin running in. I'm watching... You watch over me, and I've got the greatest view from here. What? Was that a quote from Silverchair? Anyway, can we translate? Sorry. I don't, I don't know what I'm saying. I'm not very confident, but how was it? Oh, you yeah, go? Oh, I don't know much about that, but how was that fucking... How good was that fucking software, hey? Oh, it's pretty shit, actually. Oh, it was fucking difficult to use the shit out of it. And there's nothing I can fucking do about it. The fuck? It's fucking useless. I can't translate it. Uh, those who... I don't think about the people who would use it. I didn't think about the people who use it. Oh, am I the person that made the software? Oh, she's critiquing my work. I guess it's this computer club, so we would be doing programming and shit. That's a dumb thing to say. I wasn't thinking about the end user. That's like number one. That's the number one thing you have to like learn when you're doing programming. I mean, I remember that was the first thing that my teacher in high school taught me about, like, ITC. is like, fucking end user is a dumb sack of fucking potatoes. You have to make it so easy for their dumb fucking minds to use it. <laughs> oh my god. He didn't say it quite like that, but he basically said it like that. Like, you have to pretend that your your end user is just the dumbest fucking sack of shit to ever walk the earth. So make your software so easy to use that even they, they can fucking use it.
This is what happens to people who only think about themselves. <laughs> oh, that's great. Oh, yeah, I guess you're right. You and your son really fucking told me off. Is that what it says? Yeah, I'll get there in a minute, hang on. Come on, translate. Oh, I didn't think him and I would say that to me, but she fucking did. Oh, look at that smile, though. Damn, she's hot. You know how old she is? Uh, wow, she's a really handsome young lady that I wouldn't know anything about. You were literally just talking about Rolf Ellis, by the way. Oh god, I was there. I was literally just talking about Rolf Ellis. Harris, Harris, god damn it, I can't speak. Weren't you also, uh. Well, that's not really related. I'm just gonna reset the thing here again, just to make sure. It's good. Time to kangaroo, damn sport. Time to kangaroo, shut up. Seize. What is Seize? Well, I, I guess she's cheering me up and telling me to try harder, but what? Are, yeah, she's just saying try your best. Seize? Hang on, stop everything. I'm gonna go to my Japanese English dictionary on my phone and look up what Seize means. I guess it just means. Hang on. God damn it, you fucking cunt. <laughs> uh, got fat fingers. I think my phone's dying. Seize, at the most, at best, to the utmost, as much as possible. Yeah. Well, there you go. I probably won't remember that tomorrow, but that's a probably a useful word that I should remember. Oh, what a wink. See, I joined the computer club so I could play video games, not to fucking do programming. <laughs> Training camp ends today. I don't know anything about this game, apart from what I watched on the Tim Rogers fucking review of this game. I remember, I thought it was Himeno, the, this girl, the Yurino, where at certain, like, story moments of the, in the game, there's like an RPG battle that happens? Is that? Oh. I think I might regret my life forever. <laughs> but I think I might actually defer to Justin, because he's actually here watching me stream today. And I'll let him decide what I do here. Because I think we did this last, last week, last year too, right? I think I, I, I resisted the urge. <laughs> Excuse me. Oh no! Looks like someone's taking a bath! Looks like three people are taking baths, but yeah, whatever. Alright, what have we got? Lucky Nozoicha. Nozoicha? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, Meto. Yeah, okay, so the first option is, yeah, fuck yeah, let's have a little looky. Let's have a little looky at those little peepers. Anyway, uh, and the bottom one is, no, I should really not do that. That's a real, like, that would be really irresponsible and immature of me to, uh, to break the privacy of another human being. And I should totally not <coughs> look. Uh, at what they may or may not have uh, going on. 
So just to decide what you want me to do. I already know what the answer is, but... I think I've been drinking too much rum. <laughs> Allow him to fucking decide your life like this. I mean, if it takes too long, I'm just going to decide for him, but... Did you find out that he's not actually here? Well then, fuck him. You know, while, while, we're, while we're thinking about it... So once again, Justin. You have the choice of peeping on the girls, or not peeping on the girls. Of course she is. Of course he's going to peep on them. Not only did he say that he's got a peep on them, which I totally predicted, he said, and I quote, let's look at those milk producing buddies. Justin Caledron, 2024. Can we... I don't want to get fucking cancelled like Rolf Harris. Uh, what is that? What is this Japanese, by the way? Like, Lucky's like, oh yeah. No zoi cha. The zoi cha. Maybe that means like peak. Hang on, let me let me look it up. I'm gonna I'm gonna give Justin a chance to change his mind. And please be a mature human being and not not fuck up my love life. Cause I mean, I hear like the alcohol. I'm ninety percent sure that um I'm ninety percent sure that um Uh, like, if, like, you're caught or whatever, which you probably almost assuredly are. Uh, no mind change. Great, thanks. Free those boobs. They're already free! They're over there free! We don't need to free them! Don't have to look at them for them to be free! Anyway, the point I was trying to say was, um, I'm pretty sure whoever, like, you look at, like, ha like their respect for you goes down. And this could be like a bomb inducing event. <laughs> I don't actually know. But anyway. I wonder what this is. So, what is it? It's no. Zo. E. Oh, this isn't what I wanted to look at. No, you're right, it's not. But anyway, I'm just gonna do you. No, you wanted to English look up the word. Peak. Uh, well, Nozoku is to peep. To peak, sorry. Yeah, I guess, yeah. Because I remember, I remember, um, I remember, yeah, Tim Rogers saying, like, because I think Tim Rogers was in Japan. I don't know what he was doing at the time, but he was in Japan in the 90s. I think he was, was he exchange studenting at the time? I forget. But he was, like, talking about how he knew girls who talked like the the way that they speak in this game. And I guess it's just a, a way of speaking, a way of Japanese that... Probably doesn't exist anymore. I'm re I'm really sure in um in this game nobody ever says mecha. Yeah. Or or majide. That's like that's how the girls talk now. Well, not how the young no girl it's usually girls that say majide. Majide is like no way. Or or yeah majide is like uh, for real. <laughs> like in, uh... Jesus, I almost forgot his name. Sak Sakamoto? Ryuji, Ryuji, yeah. I, I didn't even want to, I didn't want to read that last comment, Justin, that's... No. There is steam, because it's a, it's a shower. There are boobs, because of course there are. But there is no boat. 
I'm gonna go talk about it. Alright, let's just do it. Let's just do it before we fucking change our mind. Dora ga i kana. Oh god, I hate my life doing this. You're gonna, ma you're gonna make me lose this game. You're gonna make me fucking be forever alone or whatever. Which one is better? I don't know. Oh, 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 I have to pick the window. Right, because there's three of them. So there's left, middle, and right. Yeah, left, middle, and right. Alright, I'll let, I'll let Justin choose. What do you reckon, left, middle, or right? I'm kind of, I'm kind of partial to the left window, just because of, uh... I know it doesn't, I know, I know it doesn't actually mean anything, but it's just like the... The silhouette looks a lot, lot nicer on the left, but... Alright, uh, Justin has chosen the right window. You know, if it was you, you know, do you reckon that... I don't think that would be good for you, no. Oh. Who's that? I don't even know who that is. Ah, my heart is cleansed. Okay. Why, why is the shampoo called S2? It's funny, actually, you know what, it's, it's actually pretty interesting. Justin, did you also see S2 in that shampoo bottle? Because now that I'm looking at it, it's not. It's just a, um... It's just a, a double shape. Like a, like a, a, um... Like hair kind of shape. But I totally saw S2. I thought it was an Evangelion thing. So, I guess nothing bad happened out of this. Oh. Oh, shit. Ah, uh, someone's fucking peeping. Uh-oh, S2 engine for sure. Why S2 engines? Does it, is this going to lower my stress? Because, like, the, no, like, the narrator. Protag. He literally said, like, ah, I feel rel rel relieved or whatever. What's happening? I feel like there's gonna be like a, a banjo chick with like a um a kendo stick who's gonna like beat the shit out of me. Yo bye! I gotta run away. Oh yeah. Oh no, I gotta run. Ooh, what's this? I feel like something really bad's about to happen. Uh, looks like you managed to escape. I feel like I saw your face. You mean, maybe they saw my face? Oh god, did they see my face? Justin, what have you done to me? Hang on. It says I saw your face, but, you know, Google Translate sucks, so... Well... Cool. Okay. Well, uh, my stress is... Oh, that bumped my stress up a bunch. Yeah. Well, no, no, you had a whole week of... Astro, I did. You wanna go for another date? Yeah, I do. You know much I love dates. Maybe don't take it to the junk shop this time. Well, next week I'm totally taking a little joke shop anyway, but... Was this something else you wanted to talk about? Yes. Yes. We're going to talk about, in length, the Evangelion stream later on. Okay. But first, would you like to go on a date with me? On the 1st of September. And how about we go to, uh, what the fuck does she like? She doesn't like video games, right? I don't know. She likes the zoo, right? Does she? Take her to the park. Really? 
You wanna take it to the local park? Yeah, fuck it. Ooh. Well, she accepted my date, so that's cool. Well, I got a date. Alright. I feel like that fucking, uh... That event is gonna fucking bite me on the ass sometime in the future. Oh, I can't wait. Wait. So, let's talk about Evangelion. We're gonna have S2 organs, or engines. So, first thing. Uh, I'm... Still one hour away from finishing uh, Neo Justice Evangelion Anima. Uh, and after I, I feel it, I should be able to finish it before I go to start my trip to Australia. And then I'm going to try to listen to... I don't know if I'm going to get through the whole lot of it, but I'm going to listen to it, as much of it as I can while traveling. Anyway. The Evangelion stream, which we've already done, like, a bunch of Evangelion streams. We did a bunch of, like, comparison streams uh, earlier this year. But for the Evangelion stream, i.e. the anniversary of Second Impact, uh, I want to listen to Anima. Uh, not really sure how that's going to go down, but here's what I want to do. I've worked it out. Uh, so there are five books, audio books. I mean, there are five books, but yeah, there are five audio books. The first, uh, is six hours long. The second is... How long, how long is the second one? Let's have a look. The first one is six hours and one minute. The second one is eight hours and 43 minutes. The third one is nine hours and 20 minutes, which is quite long. The fourth one is seven hours and ten minutes, and then the, f the fifth one is six hours and thirty-seven. I'm gonna blow my nose. My nose is going nuts. <coughs> Excuse me. Sorry about that. Just turn my air conditioner. Uh, so that that third one is really long. Yeah. But what I thought was, unfortunately, I did take a couple of, I got like some, some days off in September. But they're all like public holidays, I'm, I'm not going to be able to like, sit out here and listen to six hours, or six to nine hours, of uh, an audio book. So what I thought I would do, where's my calendar? If you look at a... Uh, a calendar of September. What, you know what? You can just do it here, you fucking moron. Oh, yeah. What an idiot. Sorry. Okay. So, third impact is here, right? Second impact. Second impact is here, yeah. Uh, so I've got... So that's a public holiday, so I'm kind of... I'm kind of busy. Also, Saturday and Sunday are also kind of tough. I do have... I do have the 17th off. The days I have off are... Do I have Thursday off? I want to say no. Alright. We're going to have 13, 14, 15, 16, 17 off. Okay. Which is five days. Perfect. I can do, you know, one audiobook a day. Uh, except it's not really going to work that well. So what I, th what I was thinking I was doing is I'd do, for Monday the 9th, do an audiobook a day. Um... And then finish on Friday the 13th. Which would make sense. Uh, the only trouble is... Uh, okay, so... I think I've got just enough time... Before I have to go to work on Monday... To do book one. I've got just enough time before I go to work on Tuesday... To do book two. Whatever it was. So, however, Wednesday... The nine hour and... What, how many hours was it again? Nine, nine hours and 20 minutes? Yeah, I'm never going to finish that. I also have just enough time to do book four on Thursday. But I have a, I have a bit extra time. Well, I've, I've, got, I've got Friday off. Right. So what I thought I'd do is I'd do some, maybe six hours of, of book three on Wednesday. 
the rest of it on Thursday, and then, I don't know how many hours, some of book four on Thursday, then the rest of book four on Friday, and then book five also on Friday. So I think that's what I'm going to do. Now, obviously I cannot play the audiobook on stream. That would certainly fuck me over. Uh, I, I wonder if I can get away with showing the, the the English translation of the book. I mean, I can at least show pictures. We'll say. What I was going to... Because what I was going to do is I was going to, like, um, have, like, a time... A timeline. So you know how far in the audiobook I am. I also want to listen to, um... Evangelion music at the same time. So I'm going to start preparing, probably during my Australian trip actually, I'm going to start uh, in down, downtime on my Australian trip, I'm going to start preparing a, uh, a playlist, a YouTube playlist like I did last year, uh, with a bunch of Evangelion songs and albums. Um, and that'll be public and you can just listen to Evangelion music if you like. But yeah, we're going to be listening to that music while we're also listening to the audiobook, while we're also reading the audiobook. Cool. So that's the plan. That's the plan for um, the Evangelion stream this year. Yeah. Yeah. It's a good one. Alright, well, let's get out of here. Um... So, yes. Uh, oh, yeah. So, the next the next Tokyo Becky Memorial might be... The next episode might be a little bit late. Because um, I should get back to uh, Japan on the 18th. Though, that's like midnight. So, I might record it the next day and then put it out. So, it might be a little bit late, but... No one. Uh, Alright. Uh, but, uh, and then I'll, I'll tell you all about my Australian trip in that video. So, yeah, true. Uh, but for now, my name is Leo, and I'll see you next time. Actually, can you just move that cursor? I probably won't need to actually look at it, but it's just useful you know, to know the date that it currently is. Anyway, yes, my name is Leo, and I'll see you next time.